and Texas comes away with it. Now here's where you got to get back. And Baba misses, but on the back side, nobody blocking out Hort. He knocks it down. And Reeves on the floor. Hort tries again a spin move on Henry, and Henry stayed right with him, but the tap up no good. Second tap does go. More offensive rebounding off to Hort. It's 6'8", one year at Wake Forest. Property of the Portland Trailblazers. Kind of threw that one up a little. You see Holman clear everybody out, and that'll have Hort wide open for the offensive putback. Now to a two-point lead for Texas now. Get Bearfield with six of seven for three-point against Stockton. Season I-29. Horn into another double team. This one's Markel Brown and Kadeem Jack and gives it up. Nearly threw it away. Good tight defense. Robertson on Matthias. But Burrell's open for the free throw line. There's Horn again. Another rebound and he puts it up and in this time. Great setup by Kim Purcell on the baseline there. He'd been coming up to the wing on previous possessions. Oh, man, what a finish by Jalen Ford. No whistle. Akun Purcell now for a three. Misses that. Baba clears it up behind. It's Ford one-on-one -on -one with Markel Brown. No match there as Ford much bigger and quicker and gets it to the rack. He goes up. I can't say anything about that. Nothing but hang time and a reverse layup. How about Ford for a three? You'll say anything about that? All alone on the reverse. That's been the story of his night Boy, on has. the offensive, or the scoring side of the ball, I should say. Texas gets it inside to Hoard, and he scores. If you're going to close out that hard on Bearfield, as you should, given the way he shot the ball from three, it's going to leave some opportunities to make plays in the middle of the lane like he just did. Hoard with his back to the basket, finger rolls it in. Sorry you missed that one, because a Cooper Stell just threw it down. And as quick as I can describe it, Horton comes down and lays it in. Tenth double-digit scoring game in 15 play. Horton has it left at the paint, looking for his career high as the rookie, and he gets it. Opportunity there to cut it to single digits. Right side home and lobs it up to Horton. Up he goes, throws it down.